So WWE over the past week, you can watch on Peacock. You can watch on the network while the network still lives. Um, they did five episodes of the 50 greatest women in WWE since 1993. Um, I have a couple qualms about the list. Mostly Alicia Fox is not on the list, which upsets Alicia me. Fox. That, that's disgusting. Very much. Yes. It upsets me very much. But that's the only person that's not on the list that I think is is – should be on the list. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, I would take off Lacey Evans, who is on the list. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Like, yeah. that. Uh, that's an easy swap. But um, I wanted to run down the top 15. Top 15 is better than I think a lot of you would think. How many have you have any of you guys seen this yet? I no, no. Okay. All right. So these are spoilers. If you if you don't want to know the top 15, skip ahead like five minutes or whatever. Um, so at number 15, we have Molly Holly. Okay. Ooh. At number fourteen, we have Victoria. Okay. At number thirteen, Alexa Bliss. At number twelve, Mickey James. Number eleven, Beth Phoenix. Number ten, Bailey. Number nine, Ronda Rousey. Number eight, Lita. Seven, Alundra Blaze. Six, Sasha, Sasha Banks. Number five, Asuka. Number four, China. Number three, Becky. Two, Char Char. And number one is Trish. Where's Bull Nakano on this list? Oh, Bull Nakano is on the list. Where? She is on the list. Uh, she's in like mid-20s, I think. How is she not top 15? Because she wasn't in the company that long. She wasn't in the company that long. Um, I will say... One of the ones, uh, Paige was number nine, uh, Paige was 17, AJ was 19. I forget where the Bellas are, but one of the big things I had the Bellas are grouped together. Mm. Which, I mean, you know, I'm not a huge Nikki Bella guy, I think Nikki Bella's top 20. I think she should be longest reigning Divas champion, you know. All that stuff, like, I think it's deserved. But um, okay. the the only the only switches I would make is Alexa and Bailey are too low on the list, for my personal taste. Like Ronda should not be number nine. No, Ronda should not be above Bailey and above Alexa Bliss. Ronda should not be above above. Ronda's lucky Alexa to be Bray, on the like, list, as far as I'm all. concerned. Yeah, like I I would I would switch around. Alexa and Rhonda put Alexa at nine and Rhonda at thirteen, and then I would make I would switch Bailey and Becky. To be perfectly honest, I, I think I think I think Bailey deserves to be top three. If we're talking pure talent, well, they they kind of talk they kind of talk or is it everything. like everything. Okay, they kind of talk all encompassing. Because I was gonna say like Jackie, Jacqueline. I mean, Jackie is on Jazz. there. I think. Hold on, let me see if I can find the whole list of it. Like, there are a lot of thing, a lot of, a lot of women that deserve a higher spot than Ronda Rousey. Hmm. Ivory, just done talent alone, and <laughs> pure grit, as we like the as as the new wrestling term likes to say. Let's see. Sorg, what did you think of the list? I'm prepping the next segment, so sorry. Oh, but actually, right. so I'm uh, prepping the next segment, and then I got distracted because I wanted to see if Fear and Loathing still had the Queen of Insanity match on Peacock, and it does. So, uh, yes. So, sorry. I was doing some extra research. No, that's fine. <laughs> um, but I, I was a little upset that, huh. um, like, there there were some, there were, like, God, I can't find, I can't find them on the, uh, on the watch my call on the network. Okay, I, I'm I'm looking at it now. Oh, you got the whole list, Riz? I got the whole list. Okay. Tony oh. Storm Tony Storm's fifty. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Sonya Deville's on the list. That's not that's good. That's good. Yeah, like I said, the list like, surprised me. And I think well Sonya Sonya gets uh, extra points, I think, for being representative too mm-hmm. on this one. Absolutely. Like I mean I think that that weighs in you know just like just like great Khali, it's not as just as wrestling acumen that got him the right. hall of fame right yeah it's it's what he did for you know his people 
So, mm -hmm. you know, by I'm being there. I'm surprised Sable is that high. I, I wasn't surprised Sable was that high. Sable's number 16. You yeah. know who I was surprised that was on the list at all, and it kind of irked me a little? Steph. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Stephanie but McMahon she started the women's revolution. Sorg, she, Sorg, she Sorg. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Sorg. Sorg, what number do you think Stephanie is on the list? Uh, what did you just read, the top 10? I, I read the top 15. top 15. Top 15? I bet she's top 20. Nope. Nope. Really? The placing kind of scares me too. Hmm? Like, like once we discuss, once you like the placing of where Stephanie McMahon is above and below who <laughs> Stephanie yeah. McMahon is between, <laughs> kind of irks me a little bit. Okay. Yeah, Stephanie is right above Luna Vachon at twenty three, and right below Michelle McCool. And two spots above Io Shirai. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, like it's uh, so, like it, when you look at the whole list just as the thing, some of them don't make sense at all. Right, right, right. But I will say, I think the top 15 is actually fairly solid. The top 15 is accurate. Like, yeah, like, I, like I'd like i move Rhonda down a couple spots, but Rhonda, given the exposure that mm -hmm. she helped with the company, like, let's, let's be honest. If there was no Rhonda Rousey, there would not have been Evolution. Mm -hmm. No. It wouldn't have gotten women main eventing WrestleMania. No. Not at all. Like, that's... So, I mean, you know. She's not top ten, but top fifteen, sure. Um, they they put a lot of emphasis on the now talent, like the well, talent. Well, it, it was from it was from nineteen ninety three on. Yeah. So like they so they avoided having to do like a whole spotlight on Mula mm -hmm. and the Young. Like they did they did many stuff like people who pay, who paved the way for for before this era. And uh, and they did they did stuff for like managers and general managers and stuff like that. So that's where your Sonnies and Vicky Guerreros and things would come in. Yeah, where's where's Tori? DX Tori? Yes. Or Tor no, DX Tori's not on there. Tori Wilson is though. I know. I was saying where's Tori? You know who I was a little upset, but and, and I get it. The Iconics are not on there. Yeah, they're in space. I jail. get it. I get they're, it. They're in space jail. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs> well, you get it. You get it. yeah. Man, I I feel like their best years are still ahead of them. So I would hope. I would hope for sure. So, um, well, on that note, hey, so 